In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a custom view to display only birthdays. First, we need to switch to the View tab, and on the Change View button, we choose Manage Views, and then we're going to click New. We need to create a table view. First, we need to name the view, and we want to select a table view, and you can choose whether this is visible on this folder or on all calendar folders. Then we set up a filter go to the Advanced tab, and from the field, you want to go to Appointment Fields and choose Recurrence Pattern. You only need to do the Recurrence Pattern if you want to limit it to one or a few months. Type in your comma delimited list and click Add to List. If you want to show all birthdays for the year, you don't need to use the Recurrence Pattern. Then we're going to put in a filter for subject contains birthday. Add that to the list so that we don't get um, holidays such as Lincoln's birthday. We're going to add categories doesn't contain holidays. And we add that to the list. Click OK. If we want to highlight the birthdays by month, uh, such as the November ones in brown and the December ones in red, we would create an automatic filtering rule. Choose olive for the November ones. And here in the conditions, we will go to advanced and then again to the recurring pattern. Contains November. We'll add that to the list. And then we'll add another automatic formatting rule for December. Change this to red and set the condition for recurrence pattern contains December. Okay, And we will apply the view and you can see that we have a December and a November birthday shown and they are in different colors. If you want to show all of the birthdays we would go to the Advanced tab and remove the Recurrence pattern. And this will show us all of the birthdays for